British expats who want to live in Spain without working will now have to prove they have over £23,000 in their bank accounts and apply for a visa. Non-lucrative visas have always been a popular way for non-EU citizens to gain residency in Spain. After Brexit, UK citizens too who want to live on sunny Spanish shores will be able to apply for non-lucrative visas for five years before obtaining permanent residency. But to get the visa Britons will have to prove they can sustain themselves in Spain without a job for the first year of residence. Britons, and other non-EU citizens, will have to have at least 400% of Spain's IPREM indicator. But since January 1, 2022, the IPREM rose to €578.02 per month, meaning British applicants will have to prove to have funds above €27,792.96. £23,200, in their bank accounts. This is an overall £500 increase compared to applicants who applied in 2021. Britons who will want to travel to Spain and other EU countries for a holiday this year will also incur extra costs. The European Commission has confirmed travellers from the UK will be charged a £5.88 visa fee from later this year and forced to pre-register their details before being allowed to enter Schengen EU nations. The European Travel and Information and Authorisation Scheme, ISHAS, currently allows residents of 61 non-EU countries to enter the Schengen zone with pre-authorization. Rather than needing a visa, the scheme charges a levy, which permits holders to stay in and travel around Schengen signatory EU states for up to 90 days. From late 2022, as part of post-Brexit arrangements, the UK will be added to ISHAs, covering all Schengen area nations as well as a number of non-Schengen micro-states such as the Vatican City. The ISHAs scheme was first unveiled by the EU in 2016 as part of an effort to bolster security by allowing emigration officials to track visitors through the bloc, while not needing to impose a laborious visa scheme when traveling between member states. When it was introduced, then-President of the European Commission Jean-Claude Juncker praised the scheme as improving the management of EU borders, helping to decrease crime and terrorism, and reinforcing the bloc's visa liberalisation policy. Currently, EU, EA and Swiss citizens can travel to the UK for holidays or short trips without needing a visa. As non-visa nationals, they can visit the UK as a standard visitor without needing to apply for a visa in advance of travel and can seek entry at the UK border. Standard visitors are able to stay in the UK for up to six months. In contrast, UK citizens making short trips to the EU, EA or Switzerland can stay without a visa for up to 90 days in any 180-day period, 